To defeat your opponent, you must become your opponent. What's your wild rabbit? And we are back live, getting ready for this final matchup. Maurice Ashley, he can still hear me, but he is nervous. So I just want to point that out to everybody that Maurice, hey man, you sweating a little bit? Definitely. I, you know, I have to move quickly a one minute. I, I don't know, given how quickly he's played as well, how well I've seen him play so far. I, I just hope I have enough time because his resistance is going to be the whole thing. How quickly I can somehow get an advantage. All right. And Jizzy, you seem you know pretty optimistic right now. Rizzo, what say you, man? What do you think about this match of 10 minutes for your boy against one from Maurice? Well, this is, this is, for me, the rematch of the century. You know, like a few years ago, some years ago, Maurice came to the studio and put a whipping on me, just a, a master killer. And it was five minutes to one minute. And none of us was able to get a victory f on him. Um, but since then, you know, it's been a lot of games. Jizzers, as you can see, his game is extremely improved. And now he has double the odds. So... This should be real exciting and real interesting. I'm really interested to see what comes out of this. And I got to honestly say, Jizza is looking for revenge today, guys. So, <laughs> so, <laughs> so let's see what happens. It's going to be two games too, right? Uh, I believe so. I just get confirmation of that. And, you know, how are you guys? You guys feeling ready for your, your game? Yes. I'm good. Let's make it happen. Let's get the show on the road. Let's do it. Let's go. Uh, so we're about to see does it have 10 minutes to Maurice is one Maurice you better have those wrists stretch you know those fingers ready it's not easy playing with one minute <laughs> thank you Robert <laughs> uh, and we do have the game underway Maurice has the white pieces and he just dropped his bishop out and look at you playing bishop e6 putting pressure on c4 Rizzo what do you think about the opening so far light and fast I mean, this is this is kung fu at its best. And Maurice has to. He needs to move as quickly as possible. But he's kind of quiet. I thought he was going to be trash talking. Maurice, where's your head at? I ain't trash talking this guy right now, man. I got to get my game going. <laughs> oh. And Jizz is super quiet. <laughs> because we're all focused is what it is. Look all at right, this guy. He's not making any mistakes yet. <laughs> James, what do you think about the early going here? Um, Maurice keeping a great pace, honestly, great pace here, but Jizza got time and he fighting. I mean, this is not clear. Like nobody's getting crushed or nothing. This is going to be a, uh, a fight as you see, look at that. Bishop retweet B5, Queen C2. Man, I'm not liking him playing this well, man. I'm not winning yet. He playing it well, isn't he? He <laughs> really is. Rizza, he's not normally this quiet when you're playing chess, right? Just, oh, he just, is super focused right now. He has all brain muscles moving. Um, and uh, he's he's responding fast. He, this is the fastest he, was, he responded all day, in fact. <laughs> well, Maurice did just snag a pawn, so I can sense that Maurice feeling a little bit better about his chances, but he only has 33 seconds. And Jizza continues to move at a pretty lightning pace himself. Oh, the Queens came off. So we got into the end game. How's uh how's Jizz's end game, Rizza? How how does he do here? I think his end game is good. He 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 he's always, you know, he he understands hanging pawn principles. He understands isolated pawn principle. That's actually one of my weaknesses. So let's see how how he uh okay. I would say part of the issue is when somebody has you know, 27 seconds left, the game should be as complicated as possible. But right now, honestly, Jizz is putting up some really stubborn defense. James, it's only a one pawn deficit. You think he has it in him to hold us off? Uh, yes, actually. Well, now two. Okay. Well, maybe one. Let's see what he does. Let's see. But I think he can hold it here. He's actually fighting. This is uh, very, very tough for him to face this. And oh. I think Jizz is taking the, 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 the time advantage. He's using, he utilized, he's utilizing his time advantage. He knows that. Oh my he... gosh. I just <laughs> blundered. I he saw blundered. Your... I saw uh, Maurice's face. He was not happy. I blundered. Did you see the draw allowed? Oh, I saw it, but I wasn't going to say anything because I didn't want to give any hints. We'll definitely show that after the game. But wow. What a tenacious defense, though. I mean, look at this game. Yeah, Maurice, you got down eight seconds. Pawn. Oh. 
Oh, I blundered. And Maurice is 7.2 seconds, so he's going to have to pre-move some moves here, but it looks like he's getting that queen. We got it. Here it comes. <gasps> oh, my gosh. I pre-moved. Did you see that blunder? <laughs> that would have been a terrible pre-move. Oh, my gosh. That was awful. <laughs> Maurice, your face is awesome when you pre-move. You get, like, all scared. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> I made? Oh, now I got to win this game. You got to go. You got three seconds. Uh, but you can, I, I, you got this, man. Just pre-move it out. Oh, that was also a bad pre-move. Ah, <laughs> right, it was. It Whoa! Been a stalemate. You got it, man. Wow. You got it. One second left. I need to show it. Six. You know, Jizz, if, you went, if you went the other way with your king here, like towards the end, when you went king on the sixty-third move, you went king C one. Yeah. If you went king E one. Because Maurice had pre-moved, he would have put his queen on G2, and that would have been a stalemate. <laughs> wow. Unbelievable. I can't believe that nonsense. That oh, good. I had no that time left. I had wow. To go. That was exciting, guys. Great game, Just Maurice, Kung Fu, sword plays impeccable. That was uh that was remarkable right there. But just got a chance to revenge here, right? You get, you get he one does. more shot at it. He does. He gets one more chance. Hey, wow. Jizza, did you learn anything from that first game? Like, what are you going to change about your strategy? What happened? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Maurice Slashley. <laughs> 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 Maurice Slashley, bro. <laughs> 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 Woo! Great. Yeah, man. He, he still got it. I, well, I, hate to, I hate to give advice in the middle of a match. Uh -oh. Given that I, you know, but since I won the first game already, I'm going to give you a little bit of advice. You're playing badly on the time. You're not handling your clock time properly. You got two minutes and 27 seconds only that you use on the clock. Right. Maybe next time you should slow it down and try to, you know, think about your moves so you don't make the same mistakes. You played well, but you're playing too fast. Although to also give Jesus some credit here, you only had 1.6 seconds left at the end of that game. So yeah, I was many, but I was winning. Like I, I was still winning. So, so the, the point is, if he had slowed down, there was a moment in the game, we could talk about it again afterwards. Like there are a couple of moments in this game, if he had slowed down, he would have found the right moves. Yeah, yeah I, I thought about that afterwards. I, it, it seemed like I was playing like I only had 10 seconds left. Exactly. <laughs> I, mean, I, want, I want you to do that. So, you know, be careful because... You got a I, one I'm minute. So used one to minute playing not a lot. Games. So, I'm thinking we both had a minute for some reason. I snapped into that mode. Exactly. 